And the Oscar goes to... We use the Oscars as a marketing right. platform. He's a good storyteller in a town that likes good stories. He had a gift for making actors and directors feel like they were artists. He's liable to say anything when he gets worked up. I'm going to take out a full-page ad in Variety tomorrow that says, Hickenlooper is a loser and don't ever hire him for anything because he's a fucking idiot. He started raving and ranting and charging around the room. I said, uh, I don't know. And he goes, I don't know. If there's something going on, people say, I'm sure Harvey's behind it. <laughs> this is a, a new mafia of young filmmakers and young actors understood that every vote counted, that you could lose by one vote, which means you could win by one vote. Shakespeare in love. Miramax's charter was always to make something new and different, almost like Star Trek, to boldly go where no one had gone before. They took culture and sold it as entertainment. It was a game changer. Been more polite to us, sure. But the end of the process was he delivered us Oscars. There's something to his dark arts that we do not understand. This whole story is totally exaggerated. I'm going to take out another ad in Variety that says George Hickenlooper is a liar and lies to Harvey Weinstein. No one's ever going to hire you. Quick. <laughs>